Hey guys, we're Stalwart here with Thinner Athlete. We're talking about how awesome sleds are this week. But one reason I love sled is because it mimics the exact sprinting pattern. So it mimics this thing right here. So, I have myself a decently heavy sled right here. Sleds are pretty much relative to where you're pushing and how much weight is on because of the, uh, the surface more or less. So right here we have a lot of pebbles that are coming up out of the turf. So because of the pebbles, it adds more friction. More friction is heavier to push and whatnot. Um, anyways, that's kind of besides the point. What I'm getting at here is pushing the sled is awesome for tons of reasons. One, because it mimics the sprinting pattern. So, for example, when you put your hand on the sled right here, you're gonna have to brace to make the, make sure that everything's solid. So the sled is pushing down to your arm, which pushes into the shoulder, which leads to the core, which follows through a stable hip, and then you're working the legs individually. So essentially, by pushing a really heavy sled or running a slow uh, a leg sled, excuse me, you can actually work your core, work your shoulder stability, work your trunk stability, your core, right? and working your hips. This is actually the center of your core, right? In addition to that, you're driving one leg at a time. That's single leg training at its finest. So big drive right through here, and then big drive other side. You're working the contralateral, the opposite side core. What could be better? So I'm gonna get on this sled right here, right here, and you'll follow me as I drive this. So right here in that start stance, big drive, drive, drive. So as you can tell right there, you get that knee up and you're pushing back all the way powerfully, fully extending, just like you would in the sprint. So right, a lighter sled you can drive faster for longer. A heavy sled, it's the same pattern, you're just pushing harder. One other fantastic thing about the sled is you can actually drag it. So come follow me along over here. So what I've done here, essentially you've got the TRX, attach it to the sled, grab the handles, and you can sit down in a nice little hockey stance. Boom. Arms up right here. Shoulders are packed. And you just back pedal right here. So nice that leg stance and drive in this way. This exercise is unreal because of two things. Again, the sprinting thing, the whole deceleration part, right? You're in that athletic stance. Also, you feel a nice little burn on the thighs. Great finisher for a workout. Lastly, hockey players, lateral sled. So again, you can grab the handles just to choke up a little bit. Drop this leg under, push it all the way up. That's your lateral crossovers, right there. Uh, if you have a sled, give this a shot, let me know what you think. If you don't have a sled, use a treadmill, same thing. Uh, make sure you use the hashtag JotoPro on Facebook or Twitter.